Okay, hi everybody. Screwed this up, so I had to turn my camera off and try to fix it. Um, my dark green, I had it too thick. My white, I forgot to stir it after I added the um, pouring mediums in there. So we're going to try this again. It's going to be a mess because I got rubbing alcohol on this along with some dribbled black paint and whatnot. So we're just going to start off from where I left off here and see what kind of mess we can make. I just threw in a spaghetti spoon just to see what kind of um, design would come off of it, you know. This good thing about this stuff is it could be washed up, cleaned up, sanitized, and I can put it right back in my drawer. Okay, let's try the dark green again. Um, I had it way too thick before. It's pouring now, so that's cool. Alrighty. <laughs> Let's try a little bit more light green, shall we? This is just an old Bill Cosby album that I was going to throw out. And I thought, hey, I got interested in this type of art about, I don't know, maybe a month ago with that. Just decided, after watching everybody on YouTube doing it, I'd give it a go. I love it. I love it. Okay, let's just do... A little bit of squigglies in along with this black paint and my here's my rubbing alcohol mess right there um, the rubbing alcohol when you take heat to it is supposed to um, help make the cells pop and um, we'll just see what we can see a lot of youtubers use music to their demonstrations but I like to talk through mine especially since I'm a beginner and like my motto is, I don't know what I'm doing, so I just like to talk to y'all and let you know what's going on in my mind, if anything. <laughs> <coughs> Pardon me. Uh, let me get my drip tray, folks. Where did I put that baby? Ah, hang on. <sighs> you know me, lack of organization here. I decided to do this last minute before I get dressed to go get my precious rosykins. It's Friday, so we're going to do grandma and granddaughter time. We're going to go dink around in town. Maybe go to McDonald's or something. So we'll just see what this thing's going to be. I know I've been using a lot of green lately, but hey, I believe in using up my materials. What's on hand? My lovely neighbor Debbie gave me this turntable. It's pretty cool. Just thought, hey, let's give it the old spin. Let's try something here. Yeah, ta ta ta. Yeah, ta ta ta. I put just a little piece, a little white label on the bottom of this album to plug up the hole. I usually leave the holes open to give it the storm look, but doing something different for change. Missy, missy, missy. Okay. Now we'll just do our tipsy turvy thing here. Puts extra lines into it here. Let's see what happens. When I get really good at this, I think maybe I'll have some giveaways. If anybody likes my art, speak up. I know I just started, and what I'll do is um, my better pieces. Um, I'll just show a photo of them or something. I'm not a really great videographer, as you guys all know. But maybe I'll just um, do some drawings, and if anybody's interested in my art, you know, it might be something to think about doing. Of course, I'll make sure they're good and pretty. I, w I won't raffle off my, uh, my ugly ones. 
but I'll I'll take a poll and see what y'all like and we'll go from there and my neighbor Debbie she's been wonderful she gave me this turntable she she gave me a part for my sink she brought a soup when my daughter wasn't feeling well and what else oh she gave me a nice t-shirt and oh man there was something else I'm forgetting something really important oh she brought her wood screws and drill over and helped me fix my porch because all the boards were um, just vibrated loose you know over time some of the wood screws are actually bounced right out of some of the boards so Debbie came over and together we fixed my porch so and she's she just moved in next door and um, she needs something to cover up her outlet on the living room wall and she suggested a nice piece of art and then before I left she said she would like one of my paintings so I told her when I come up with a really pretty one a really nice big one because she's going to need a nice big piece of canvas and uh, so I'll have to go to Hobby Lobby for that and uh, I'll get her something really pretty for her wall find out what her favorite colors are or her color scheme and go from there and surprise her with it I think she'll like that so anyways we got this green thing going on here I'm going to throw a little bit of heat to it to see if um, any cells will pop out and I will be surprised if anything happens because yeah I made a mess so let's give it a try it's going to be a little bit noisy I'll bring it over here for cut down on the noise the paint swirl around a little bit too. It's going to be interesting. And it also can, since I got all that alcohol in there, that rubbing alcohol in there, who knows what it's going to do to it. But um, it's probably going to cause some separation, I think, and just because I got way too much rubbing alcohol in it. But that's pretty much how it turned out. and green. A little bit of black swirl in there, but you can see just a few cells popping right by my finger. But it's and there's a little bit of white popping, but just because um yeah it's basically a mistake. It's not gonna be real professional, but there we go. Let's set this thing here. Find a clean thumb.